Okay, well, zero action yet. And guess what time it is, folks? I don't know what time it is. It is 10 bells. Robbie was supposed to meet me up here at uh, 5.30, 6 o'clock. It's 10, and he just got here. So there you have it. But he didn't miss anything other than sounded like I know of one caught at 540 this morning. Um, I was not here casting by that time. I heard there was a couple more fish on and lost at that same same time. So I'm going to uh, run in and go pick up Mr. Late Boy. I remember the last time he did that. He got a 50 incher. So I don't know. Hopefully something happens cool. Haven't not seen a fish caught yet. So all right, let's yank it. Look who I found loitering at the boat launch four and a half hours late. I thought it's it's kind of like five hours late, really. Um, yeah, didn't have my alarm on or the sound on on my phone. Lee probably called me about 10, 15 times and woke up at 6.30. We are supposed to be here at 5, 4.30. <laughs> well, I didn't catch any anyway, so, but I needed help apparently. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody catch one already. Welcome to the bay, I guess. <laughs> Well, folks, the 615 update is no muskies for us. No follows. Saw a couple laying around on side image. I got a decent little nap in. Uh, that's it so far, but we got moon in half an hour and water temps have come up nicely today. I don't know, it could be a big fish night tonight. I don't know if they're biting. <laughs> Yeah, we'll be able to tell if they're biting with the boats around. Good thing and a bad thing. So there you have it. That's all we got. Here we go. Big one, big one, big one. Come on. Come on. So slow. Why won't she bite? Oh my gosh. High 40. Yay, I had a follow, but it didn't bite. Really nice fat fish, dang it. Yeah, that was wild. Well, a 9-10 stagger. Almost. There it go. All right. Nice one. Why? <laughs> Why is it a squeaker? Why? We'll take it. We need to get those hooks out and what back cast it. It bit both. The, the gold one. <laughs> it got, has both of them. Alrighty. Well, I think I caught a Lee muskie. Lee catches these muskies on shrimps. The jankiest looking muskies. <laughs> it, let's just say it's a little special. <laughs> Got a goofy gill plate on her.
Very goofy kill plate. Nice chunky Green Bay musky. I haven't caught one of these bad boys in a long time. Oh, that's amazing. We got one. It's not what we're after, but Lee just had that big one up. It's moon right now. We got to get this bad girl back in the water here. Quick. Quick, because we've got a feeding window. Oh my gosh. There you go. Oh, are you good there? Gosh, they are just so fat in this body of water. I think you're good, girl. Water's cold. Come on. Get her head into the wind. Give her a twist. She should go and twist her. That is an interesting one. <laughs> there she goes. That's a super shad wrap special. No. <laughs> Something happened to yeah. her. Cool. Okay, we gotta go. We it's gotta get moving. casted. I feel like my camera battery's gonna die any second. It's had it on all day, yeah. Here we go. Yep. What? Oh my gosh, come on. Why? Really nice fish again. Holy cow, the window's open. Dang it. I just switched back. You see her? All right. Rob gives me a sign that she's still hanging around here. Come on. Beautiful fish. Another upper 40. Come on. Oh, I just switched back to the Nightmare Ninja regular size. So flipping close. So close. Robbie, I can't catch them on figure eights. What is the deal? You used to catch tons of fish on figure eights. It's gotten really hard now for some unknown reason. Alright folks, we're going to switch it up to the number 10 single boiler maker. Throwing that on the 9 foot 6 SWAT and the slow speed tranks. I'm switching it up. I like that slow speed reel for night rolling. I don't know, it just allow, forces me to slow down instead of the high gear. I feel like uh, those big girls like to just stock that thing slow behind it and engulf it. Okay, full moon, let's do it. All right, peeps, we're back at it again. We were not able to get it done yesterday other than the Chamber of Commerce musky. Um, got a special guest in the boat, Mr. Sterling King, which of course we will leave all the information of his guide service in the description as usual. Uh, we'll talk more with him after we get this uh, 50 plus inch out of the way here. Looks like he's rolling some eight nines, I think. Rob, I don't know what Rob's got. Rob's got the horseshoe, I got the ninja. Big weather switch today. Southwest going to north. So hopefully big things, full moon tomorrow. 
That's all we got so far. Update. What? <laughs> Nothing. Nothing. Beautiful weather, perfect moon, all the above. We have not sniffed a muskie on a lure. I don't know. I don't know what it is. The black cloud is kind of circling this area right in here. It wasn't so bad for you yesterday, Stuart. <laughs> not too bad. No. You got pretty spoiled the last couple days. <laughs> well, hopefully. Hopefully something will happen. What'd you get? A 52, a 50, and a 44 in a good 50 minute window in that last morning? Yeah, we got yeah. a 40, 44 and a half, a 50, 50 and a half, and a 52. <laughs> so it can happen. The fish are here, just they're not biting yet today. Um, I don't know, that's what Green Bay is all about. You just got to throw and hope for the best. <laughs> the grind, baby, the grind. <laughs> but Oh my gosh, I hope we catch something. We have to. It was way too nice out to, for, for, to not catch one. But it would be our luck this year. Yes. <laughs> At least it's not flat, calm, and sunny. Well, folks, where do we catch muskies? Every. Why is it getting harder and harder lately? <laughs> Don't ask the old guy. Ugh. Green Bay wasn't real nice. We did get one in the boat. That's kind of seems like all of our trips. We got one. Squeak one. out one. <laughs> squeaker, squeaker, squeaker. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. It's been a tough season for the TA crew here, without a doubt. Yeah, but uh, we were here at the right time. I, I'm not disappointed at one we came to the bay because nope. there was fish that bit and uh, it just wasn't us. Yep. We caught the big ones, which is so normal out here. Um, you're either the the guy who wins or the guy who loses the hero or the zero <laughs> we were this one half <laughs> one half yeah yeah but i'm not sure where we're off to next maybe northwoods we got a warm cup warm front coming and could be a good thing could be a terrible thing but it can't get any worse <laughs> oh man i hope it busts open next week it looks like uh, you know probably the biggest thing up in the northwoods just have not had the core temp of the lakes getting up into the mid 70s it's just yeah. been basically yep. 68 69 and for the majority of the summer and when it gets hot it's flat calm there's no wind mixing that those lakes and uh that's my excuse i'm going yep. with it yeah I like I, it. i'm with it too <laughs> yep. so you gotta have an excuse folks <laughs> yeah so comment below guys what how has your season been going is it the same as ours or hopefully you guys are having a much better season than us so that's all we know Till the next one. Yeah, it was nice getting back on the bay. It's been a while. Yes. It's been a long time actually out um, fishing the reefs. So saw a couple good animals yep. last night for it sure. Definitely makes me intrigued. Um, yeah, you, you didn't see much. Oh my oh, gosh, the yellow jacket is trying to eat the camera right now. <laughs> you didn't see much of Sterling, yeah. but uh, hopefully we'll get back out with him this September. Um, he got some really good fish the last week. So, oh man, we'll, yeah, we'll leave a little this, uh, link in the description if you guys want to get out in the bay. Um, that's where he's fishing. So, that's all. All right, goodbye. Let's go. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah.